There's a tradition in programming that when you start work with a new programming language, the first thing you should try to do is write a program that displays Hello World, just the text Hello World. So I'm going to show how to do that in Lazarus. Now here I'm using the Windows version of Lazarus, but the process is very similar in the Mac version. Now you might need to create a new project first, so you go to the Project menu and select New Project. Select Application and click OK. So this pops up a new form and a new code file ready for me to start programming. I'm going to start in the form. The form is where I design the user interface. The user interface items are across the top here in these various uh, tabbed sets of, of components. So I'm just going to stick with the standard tab. I'll put on, let me see, I'll use a T-Edit control for the uh, place where I'll display the text. So I just select that, just one click, and then release the mouse button to select it, go onto the form where I want to drop it, and I click again. And there's my edit control. And you can see in the properties over here, it has a list of properties. I could change the text, for example, if I find the text property, which is down here. And you can see I'll edit the text. And it puts the text property that I've displayed in that text edit box. Now I need a button. So I'll click the button, drop one on. And I can move it around and, and align it, either align it to the grid, the little dots, or you can see that it has these auto alignment bars to help me align it as well. So I'm not too bothered about uh, getting a very fancy user interface here, but I'll just resize this box so I've got plenty of space to put my text in. Now I want something to happen. I want the, d the text to be displayed when I click the button. So to set that I, I need to select an event. I can either do that in the events palette and I could create an event for on, uh, let's have a look, on key down, on key press, on key up, on mouse down, etc, etc. And the one I want is here on click. But as a shortcut way of doing this, Lazarus just uh, lets me double click a control on the form, so a double click button here, and it has a default uh, event. It happens to be click for a button. That's the event that's most likely to be used. And so if I wanted to set up a method for some other event, then I can select it in the events palette. But for the default event, which is here, button click, then it does it automatically when I double click. So now I'm ready to do some programming. And what I want to do is I want to put the text Hello World into the component called Edit1 when button 1 is clicked. So go back down here. This is the uh, procedure that has been created to handle the click. So I now put in the name of the control that I want to display the text, followed by a dot. Then, after a short delay, and the delay can be changed in the uh, environment, I show you elsewhere how to do that. The code completion drop down list pops up, and that provides access to properties. That's uh, the same properties that we could set in the object inspector, can also be set in code. So the edit control has a property called text. You remember that's the one that I just set in the object inspector to XXX as default. So I can set it here. And equals, I want to set it to hello world. The string delimiters in Pascal are a single quote. So I put a single quote, hello world, terminating single quote. So that's all really that is needed to get my Hello World application running. So let's try it out. Let me save everything. That's the icon up here. So I'll just put it somewhere out of the way. I'll just accept the standard uh, file names that it suggests at the moment. You can rename it as you wish in if you're doing a real application, but for the time being, I'll just accept the defaults. And to run it, I click the Run button up here. 
messages window shows me what's happening. It's recompiling. Okay, it's been successfully built. And there's my application popped up in its window. You can see the default text has been uh, placed into edit one. That's the text that I specified in the object inspector, the property. And let's see if my code executes, the code that I just wrote. And there it is, hello world. So it's as simple as that. It's really quite simple to get started in Lazarus uh, using free Pascal. And in just a, a matter of a few seconds, you can create a, a, an application with its own user interface and program some events as I've done here for button one click.